How to fix Assassin's Creed Shadow DX12 error 0x887a0006 in Windows 11? Hello friends, follow the steps to fix it. The step 1 is make sure that DirectX 12 is installed on your computer. Click on search. Type DXDIAG. Click on DXDI. This is DirectX version. The DirectX version must be DirectX 12. If you find DirectX 11 or something else, then you will need to install DirectX 12. To install DirectX 12, go to the video description and click on the link to DirectX. The link will take you to this page. Click on download. Click on this setup file. Select yes. Check the option I accept the agreement. Next, install the Bing bar and check. Click on next. Finished. Restart your computer and check if the issue is fixed. The second step is disable overlay. If you are running Assassin's Creed Shadow with the Steam client, then open Steam. Click on Steam. Setting. Select In Game. This is the Steam Overlay settings. Disable this setting using this toggle switch. If you are running the game with Ubisoft, then launch this client. Click on your username. Select settings. Go to interface and check the option for uh, enable in game overlay for supported games close if nvidia or amd graphics card is installed on your computer you can disable overlay there for amd i am showing here type overlay in the search box Disable in game overlay. Then restart your computer and check if the DX12 error is fixed. The next method is launch the game with different options. Open Steam. Go to library. Right click on the game and select properties. In the launch option, type minus windowed and try to launch the game. If this doesn't work, then type minus DX12. If this also doesn't work, you can try using DX11. If this doesn't work, you can try using D3D11. The next method is rollback NVIDIA driver. NVIDIA driver is found culprit in many cases and rolling back its driver has worked for many. So try this method. Right click on start. Select device manager. Expand display adapters. AMD Radeon graphics is installed on my computer. Do the same uh, with NVIDIA graphics, which I am doing here with AMD Radeon graphics. Right click on this uh, driver, select update driver. Click on browse my computer for drivers. Select this option. Let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Here select a previous version of the driver and click on next. By clicking on next, the driver will be installed. After that, restart your computer and check <coughs> if it works. If it doesn't work, update the graphics driver and then check. 
right click on the graphics card select update driver click on search automatically for drivers close restart your computer and check if the issue is fixed if this doesn't work delete the driver using dd utility and then install the fresh version of the driver go to the video description and uh, click on the link to ddu ddu means uh, display driver and installer or you can uh, type ddu utility in the browser press enter click on this link click on the download link downloading once downloaded go to the folder extract all extract then boot the system in safe mode close all the running tasks click on search type msconfig Click on system configuration. Go to the boot tab. Check safe boot. And here select uh, network. Click on apply. Click on ok. A pop-up will appear. Click restart on the pop-up. After booting into safe mode, go to the file explorer. Downloads folder the extracted uh, ddu utility double click on the exe file extract double click on this folder and open display driver in uninstaller.exe click on yes click on select device type Select GPU and click on clean and restart. This will clean the leftover of previous version of the drivers. Restart your computer. After restarting, go to the normal mode. To go to the normal mode, click on search. Type msconfig. Click on system configuration, boot, check and, and, and check this option, once check and then uncheck this option. Click on apply and click on ok. Restart your computer, click on restart. After coming back from the safe mode, go to the NVIDIA driver website, open a browser, type NVIDIA driver download, click on this link, download the official NVIDIA drivers, select the product category. Select uh, the correct options in these drop downs. If you are having trouble in uh, selecting these options, you can get help from system information. For this, click on search, type uh, system info, for the processor, check here. What is the version of your GPU? And then choose the option here. Then click on find. For GeForce Game Ready Driver, click on view. Click on download. Once downloaded, click on the file explorer icon. Go to the downloads, right click on the NVIDIA driver, just download it, select open, 
click on yes click on ok and follow the on screen instructions to complete the installation if the issue still persists verify the game file open the steam client go to library right click on the game select properties click on install files and click on verify integrity of game files the next method is uninstall and reinstall the game right click on start select install apps find assassin's creed shadow in the list and once found click on uh, three dots select uninstall on the confirmation pop up again click on uninstall after uninstalling go to the client application and install the game again you can use custom display settings for the game click on the windows icon from the taskbar select settings go to system display scroll down and click on graphics click on add desktop app find the x file for assassin's creed shadow and select it click on add then expand the added file click on this drop down and select high performance amd radeon graphics or high performance nvidia graphics then close the game and relaunch the game and try to play install the pending updates click on start select settings go to windows update and click on check for updates if any update is downloaded restart your computer to complete the installation run the game in clean boot click on search type ms config select system configuration go to the services tab check the option for hide all microsoft services and click on disable all then go to the startup tab click on the link open task manager make sure that all the programs are disabled these are startup programs if any one is enabled right click on the program and select disable then close the task manager click on apply and click on okay select restart here then try to open and play the game if the problem is still occurring update bios type type the manufacturer of the device bios download click on the link select if updated version is available and click on download then install the bios using the setup file keep in mind to plug in the charger throughout the process that's all friends thanks for watching the video